A number of distribution and warehouses no longer just have forklifts and clipboards. They use robots and lasers and radio frequency identification tags and a lot of complicated systems and we're looking for individuals like you to help run these machines. Do you ever wonder who maintains this incredible technology? Today we are going to hear from some of the top supply chain technicians in the field. You will need to understand how computer technology controls the mechanical functions of the automated system. Yes, uh, I used to work in production. I did it for 10 years. I, I picked boxes, threw cases on the line. I decided to go back to school. Uh, got a technical training for two years. I mean, it's had an opening. I applied for it, and I've been here ever since. If you're a person that likes to fix broken things, then supporting the supply chain companies is the thing for you. I worked for production for eight years and I got a chance to go to school, and now I got a better job with better pay. In the next 20 to 30 years, there's gonna be massive growth for technicians who can work on automation that is far beyond their imagination today. Yeah, in, in my 40 years in the maintenance field, I've only been out of work two weeks. My favorite part of the job is to come in and solve the problem. Electrical is very important in maintenance because without it, you cannot troubleshoot it or repair it. We got certain responsibilities in, in the building in our plants, and we work in these responsibilities. But there is other people working in pneumatics, working in mechanics, working in electrical, electronics, AC, you name it. As training and development manager for a large supply chain company, I can tell you there are many high paying jobs available for you. Every day I come to work, I do something different. I do electrical, I do airlines, batteries, forklifts, etc. It's never one thing. If you've ever taken anything apart or have been interested in, in building uh, robots and computers, then we're looking for you. Uh, there's high wage, high skilled jobs in automated systems.